What is up everybody? This is Prison Cooking with Brenda and I am Brenda. Before we get started, I would like to address one thing. I got some not so friendly fan mail from somebody by the name of Dustin. He asked me why it looked like I stuck my finger in a light socket. Let me tell you something, Dustin. You're lucky you're talking to the Brenda today. Because if you were talking to the Brenda a month ago, she would have sharpened a toothbrush and stubbed you in the toe with it. All right, let's begin. Today on Prison Cooking with Brenda, I'm gonna teach you guys how to make prison yak, pruno, toilet wine, hooch. All you need is a few simple ingredients. You gotta have a bag. Fruit is very necessary. We're gonna be using oranges, a ton of sugar. You're gonna have water, something to cook it in, and you need your yeast. Oh my God. I forgot to tie that up. I almost forgot to mention a very important component. Juice. We're gonna be using grape cranberry juice cocktail. Oh, that's fancy. <laughs> okay, I've already put one of these in here, so we're gonna be putting two, all right? I've peeled about six oranges. What you're gonna do is you're gonna take your bag from commissary, put all those oranges in there. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna squish them up. Just like this. So this is about what you want it to look like, right? A little mushed up, a little juiced out. I'll take these scissors. All right, I cut my bag. It is A-OK -okay to add the orange peels. Some people just throw them away, man. Oh, that's squirted in my eye. Now don't add all the orange peels from all the oranges. Just do like one orange. All right, next what you're gonna wanna do is you wanna take your sugar. One cup per one gallon of liquid, but I really wanna have some strong hooch, so I'm gonna do a little bit more than one cup. I'm gonna do two cups. So let's go ahead and get that in there. All right, now if you're in prison and you can't get your hands on all that sugar, all you gotta do is get some Jolly Ranchers or some Starburst. We're gonna add those right now just because I want more flavor. We're gonna do, we're gonna do two lemons and two strawberries. Also, I'm gonna be taking some lime juice. I'm gonna squirt a little bit of that in there because why not? This isn't gonna turn into alcohol without any yeast. I'm gonna do six slices of bread, and all you do is break them apart like this and just stuff it in there. All right, guys, six, six slices right here. All right, guys, next what you wanna do is you wanna add water. Let's go ahead and give it a little shake. Look at that. Take this cap. Screw it on just a tiny bit, because I want to have it a little bit of, you know, ventilated, it could burp itself. I'm gonna put this in my garage, I wanna keep this somewhere warm. Uh, and like I said, just a little bit, boom, that's it. Put it in the garage and just keep checking on it every day, man. Well, that's how you put it together. Uh, I guess I'll see you guys in about four to seven days. Everybody, it has been exactly nine freaking days, and I think we have ourselves a finished product. Whoa! <coughs> right here, down here, you see the yeast, it's settled to the bottom. Right here's the magic juice, this is what we've been working hard for. And then right here, we just need to get rid of all these extra parts. So yeah, let's uh, go ahead and... Uh, Let's give this a try. Okay, you can never be too protected. Oh man. I'm gonna take a coffee filter. I'm just gonna put it like this. Okay, I'm just gonna pour. All right guys, we have ourselves a nice healthy glass. 
Here we go. Let's give it. Let's give it a try. actually pretty freaking good it tastes like tastes like grapefruit it's really sour super tangy oh my god I'm freaking blown away hey Dan get in here man I need you to try my hooch why don't you give it a smell and let them know what you think <laughs> do you think there's any alcohol in this yeah just a little what, do you, what proof do you think it is? A hundred proof? I don't know. Get out of here, man. Don't flatter me like that. <laughs> God dang. Ready? Isn't it kind of good? It tastes kind of grapefruit-ish. It tastes like grapefruit, and I didn't even put any grapefruit in there. It's pretty good. I was going to see if I could catch a buzz off this, but... I don't know, I'm a little scared. So anyways, thank you so much for watching. I can't wait till next time. Remember, stay cool, stay free. Brenda, ah. Oh.